Today we are going to be doing a mean from a frequency distribution when you don't actually have the raw data. So I'm going to try and get this so you can all see it. So your frequency distribution is just the table that has the classes and the frequencies. And what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to find each of the class marks. And the way you do that is you add the lower class limit and the upper class limit, which is the 20 plus the 29, uh, which you would see here, and then you divide that by 2, so you get 24.5. Now we do that for all of the classes, and then we multiply those values by the frequencies, and then we add them. So here's your uh, 24.5, and since there's 1 in there, we multiply that by 1. And then there's your 34.5, and then there's 3 in that category, so you multiply it by 3, and so on and so forth. Uh, sorry for the video quality. Then you multiply them, and then you add up all of those values, and you're going to get a total of uh, 633. And then you add up all of your frequencies, which is what I did over here, and then you divide the 633 by the 14. And that'll give you your mean from a frequency table or a frequency distribution.